morning all day four. Good morning, left four, have this morning. Um, not too early, about seven o'clock, had a bit of breakfast and moved around and what have you. And uh, now I'm just up from a uh, little place called uh, Price, which is worth a little look if you're going past this in the little western town. It's just off here off the, uh, what am I, 121 or something like that. I forget what road I'm even on now. It's the road that goes north. I'm 100 miles or so south of um, Salt Lake City. Salt Lake City is worth a look in if you're passing it. It's got a big cathedral church, you think, going off at the top there of the uh, uh, town. And it's worth a look, it's nice. It's got some good music bars and stuff as well. Some cool bars. So if you're into all that stuff, and a nice Starbucks at the top to chill out. So it's really worth going and having a look. So I've done what have I done? 2,500 miles. Inspection thing. 2,500 miles before I've hit any serious mountain Three passes. Three quarters of a mile. Keep left on uh, the energy loop scenic highway. Scenic highway, there you go. Uh, yeah, so I've um, two and a half thousand miles, so it's not bad before I hit any mountain passes. You, whichever way you go, you gotta hit some mountains. Gotta go in some mountains. The weather's still looking good, looking grand. Happy days. This is really some route. I forget how beautiful this is coming up this way. It really is. Obviously things are gonna slow down now. I've been doing 700 miles a day for the last three days. So uh, I only need to do 600 a day now to get me home. So that's, Keep left on that's nice, which is, is gonna be slow, slowing down now, obviously, because of, uh, I'm on single track roads, right? Up until towards um, Salt Lake City. Salt Lake City, the salt flats aren't actually in Salt Lake City, they're way out of the way, they're about 50, 60 miles. Continue on US 191. As I found out when I weekended there once, I thought I'd go to Salt Lake City, I said, see the salt lakes, and they aren't anywhere near it. Obviously, do your research first, do a schoolboy error. Temperature's down at 7, uh, it's alright, it's nice and sunny, but too warm.
snow. We don't mind that. It's nice. It just makes the uh, pictures prettier, doesn't it? As long as we don't get any more than that. I'm not sure how high I am up here. There aren't any super high mountains in uh, America. I think 3,000 metres is pr uh, two and a half thousand metres is probably going to be your highest two, three, something like that. Yeah, Salt Lake City is the only uh, major city that's going to hold me up, apart from uh, Seattle, but I'll, I know how to handle Seattle at the right time. Salt Lake City is, is like London. It's, you've got all surrounding little town cities uh, coming off it and shit like that. So it does seem to drag on for a long time. It takes forever to get through. It really does. Uh, but hopefully I'll, uh, I'll try and get it at the right time. Which I am going to, if I'm only 100 miles away, uh, I'll be right. We'll be right, I'll be through it for, what, nine, to go, I get on two hours, it's still on, an hour ahead of me, so it's ten o'clock now, I'll be up there for lunch time, so that'll do. We'll miss the traffic. And hopefully I'll get through Seattle about the same time tomorrow, about lunch time, something like that, so I'm planning to hopefully be home for three, four o'clock. It goes on and on up this pass and then we come down the other side. Catch you later, bye-bye.